Hello, my name is Gummadin, and in this video, I am doing an early game guide from 0 to 25. I've been playing since the Gummy Bear event, and I hope this information helps you. There will be timestamps throughout the video, so you can jump around wherever you'd like. This guide will be looking at all the areas up to and including the mountaintop but it will not be including Onet's area or the Spear Bear area. I recommend you use these codes that will give you some specific items that will actually help you kind of speed jump into the game. Also, do not use any other codes until you're much further in the game as the boost will give you much more honey later on than early in the game. After you use those codes, make sure you to get the backpack, magnet, and two eggs, which will put you two bees away from the new area. One tip I'd like to give is to save your gold and diamond eggs as you will need them later on in quests. If you bought any game passes, this is the Event B Buying Guide. Get Tabby first as you need Tabby Love up to a thousand to get most benefit of that bee. Then Photon, Vicious, Festive, Gummy, Crimson, and then Cobalt. This is the gear progression guide that I made using a template off of Reddit. If you don't have the materials for the basic shop, don't worry about that. That's only if you have extra materials because someone popped a sprout or something. Next, what you want to do is grab all the quests, but focus on the Black Bear quest line as you eventually want to get to the repeatables and the Mythic Egg at the end of that quest line. Once you get the Mother Bear quest line, passively do that quest quest line do not actively be putting honey into bee leveling until you get to at least 25 bees after grinding a few quests you should have unlocked the basic bee area which includes spider bamboo and strawberry when you first get to this area you want to avoid the spider as your hive will not be a high enough level to do any damage to that spider do not forget to pick up your panda bear quest but do this quest line passively and focus on your black bear quest line continue grinding your black bear quest line until you have enough bees to get into the next area congratulations if you made it this point that means that you have unlocked pineapple field stump field the stump snail and the science bear but I will cover more of this in just a second. The very first thing you wanna do is grab your science bear quest and start grinding out those science bear quests with the black bear quest line because you need translators to unlock Bucko, Riley, and stick bug for future quests. Have a friend help you complete the Bemis lights quest which is offered through the science bear. Once it's completed, you'll be able to catch stars in the field which will allow you to instantly convert pollen from your backpack into honey and giving you a buff called inspire which will double the amount of pollen that you get for each stack of that while in this area do not focus on the dapper bear shop or the stump snail as you will not be able to do either of these at this time while in this area you want to focus on getting the compressor for 150k pulser for 125k and then up to 15 bees to unlock the new area congratulations once when you have unlocked this area you have unlocked the polar bear quest line you have also unlocked rose pine tree pumpkin and cactus fields the badge bears guild in this area should be avoided at this time because you will not be able to afford any of the items in this shop. Don't forget to get the polar bear quest and do it passively as you do your black bear and science bear quests. Continue grinding the science and black bear quest lines as this will allow you to convert faster at the hive and get you honey for equipment and bees. With the honey from the quest and grinding, get the portal hive first up to 17 bees and then start working on the honey dipper. Once you have the honey dipper, start working on getting up to 20 bees. Once you have 20 bees, you've unlocked the ant area, which includes the ant challenge and the gummy layer. The gummy layer can be accessed with goo hotshot and gives you free glue daily. Get the hidden tokens and do the ant challenge for the ant amulet. You should be able to get a bronze or a silver ant amulet. If you haven't already, make sure you are breaking sprouts as the materials are needed for items within the mountaintop shop and other shops in the future. Continue working on your science 
and black bear quests the buff from the science bear should help you convert at your hive faster and work on getting to 25 bees to unlock the mountain top area once you have 25 bees congratulations you have unlocked the mountain top area which includes the mountain top field the mountain top shop and the ticket shop you can also use the booster there which allows you to boost a lot of the lower fields and lets you get honey much quicker now since you are in the mountaintop area i recommend getting these items in this order the glider mondo belt beekeeper mask beekeeper boots porcelain dipper and uh, porcelain porto hive once you have the beekeeper mask and the beekeeper boots you have unlocked the dapper bear area which will unlock his quest line his shop allow you to get the planters which i recommend getting the plastic planter as soon as possible allowing you to unlock other planters in the future you can also do the bemis quest line at this time which unlocks the samovar which is a six hour cooldown but gives you nectar which drastically increases the amount of honey you can make at this point you should have the red blue and field boosters unlocked make sure to be doing these as it allows you a easy way to make more pollen in those fields that do the badges for those fields those badges are very important for mid and end game to make much more honey if this guide was helpful at all please make sure to like comment and subscribe if there's any tips or other things that i did not cover or you have something that you think i should have changed in here please let me know in the comments below i appreciate it and have a good night